Hi guys and welcome to this video by Mr Business Studies. Today I'll be looking at how to write a business plan. So the purpose of a business plan is to raise finance and capital for your setup and growth of your business and will also give you a clear idea of which path to follow when you're running your business. So here's a summary of the business plan. Firstly you start off with your business idea in the middle and then you create your executive summary, then your goals, your unique selling point, marketing, management, finances, and then finally your appendix in the back, which will contain any graphs and information. So firstly you have your executive summary. This is the summary of the entire business plan at the start of the document. It gives key points from the rest of the plan and gets the reader interested. It is not a description of the business idea, as this will come a little bit later. The aim of the executive summary is to allow the reader to know what the business is about in a few paragraphs. Goals. These are short-term, medium-term and long-term. Your short-term goals are the business goals for the first 12 months. The medium-term goals are those for the business in years 1 to 3. The long-term goals are goals for the business in years 3 to 5. The aim of your goals in your business plan is to plan where you want the business to be up to five years down the road. Unique selling point. This is the benefits and features of products or services that you offer to customers and what makes you different from the competition. The aim of your USP is to identify the business's individuality in the market. Marketing. This looks at your market position. Is the market you're entering declining or growing? Who are you trying to sell to? Where are they? And how are you going to sell to your customers? The competition. How strong is the competition in the market? And what is your message to the consumer, such as your promotion and advertising? So the aim of marketing in your business plan is to identify the environment you're selling in and how you're going to get your message to customers. Management. This is looking at who's involved in the business and the roles of key staff members and looking at their skills and qualifications. So the aim of this is to identify key staff members in management and their skills. Finances. This shows financial forecasts such as profit and loss accounts, cash flow forecasts and budgets. And the aim of this is to forecast the business financial position and show capability to repay loans etc when looking to gain finance. See our other video on profit and loss accounts to see how to complete this. So to conclude, this is what your business plan should look like. You should start with your executive summary, then go on to your goals, your USP, your marketing, your management structure, and your finances. Thanks very much for watching. If you did like the video, please click the like button, subscribe, and leave us a comment of what you thought. Thanks very much for watching again, and we'll see you next time.